Welcome to Pat's Picks. This is the Futures Trading Combine. Thank you so much for coming by. Uh, I took a day off, I think. I'm probably not going to be making the Futures videos every day. It is honestly a lot of work to make two videos a day. So I'm going to try to space them out two or three videos a day and just kind of recap it all. But anyways, without further ado, let's dive right in. Please drop a like down below. I greatly appreciate it. It really helps out that algorithm. And if you're new here, please subscribe if you enjoy it. Without further ado, let's dive right in. This video is going to be short and sweet, and uh, that is pretty much my motto. Um, so this is TS Trader. There's nothing really to look right here, so let's go on over here. And you can see today was a small green day, um, and the account is still down from the challenge. So I'm down 1,200 from reaching that goal, and uh, really just tried to pull back. I was making way too many trades. Um, if you guys haven't seen those videos, that's that's what you missed was way too many trades. And so really just dialing that back and trading these um, more how I trade options. You know, having that limited buying power is something that kind of helps you be more patient. And so with the futures, I was just kind of going wild. Um, having not unlimited buying power, but having so much buying power that I was making way too many trades. And so that was really cutting into my profits. Um, it was exhausting. And uh, yeah, the fees were out of control. So scrolling down here, you know, there's not a whole lot to look at here. Um, I think I only made a few trades today, but you can see days. I've traded five days on this account. Winning percentage, 40. And I think that's because I had three red days in a row. So the last two days were green, but they were kind of small. Actually, I take that back. There was a green day and a red day that I didn't film. So, um, yeah. <laughs> oh, it's been a journey, but, you know, I'm determined. And I know for 100% guarantee this will make me a better trader. And that is what I really look forward to is all the skills and knowledge that I really take out of this that I can apply um, in the future and continue to uh, grow my tool belt. So you can see right here, winning trade percentage, 62%. Uh, average losing trade is 71. I think that was about 120 or it was more. So I'm watching that go down while the average trade is going up, making those minor adjustments. Um, you can see today I made seven trades, 14 contracts. So it counts when you buy and sell it. Um, because each of those was only one at a time. So I think there was a couple videos ago where I was confused and there was like over 100 contracts traded. Uh, I didn't realize I was counting back and forth. So anyways, I digress. Uh, max wins. I made three wins in a row and I think that was my last three trades. It was a little bit choppy. You know, my first trade I started out green and I believe the next two were red. And then I just was patient, waited for the right setups and then took profit. So that's something I've really been focusing on, you know, trying to make sure that I'm letting the winners run and just managing the, the stop loss take profit orders. Um, so basically I have it set up over here where um, on this you just click. It's as simple as I click right here or I can go right here and buy right at the market and it will show you right here where my position is. And then I'll have a sell order and, and a cut loss order. So take profit, stop loss orders, and you can adjust them pretty easily. You can just click on them and drag them, or you can go over here and click on them and drag them. But what I've been doing recently to kind of help improve and, and just let me be more patient because I was making so many trades and scalping like a freaking maniac. I, you know, like I said, I traded over 50 trades in a day, which is like phew, some kind of world record. But uh, <laughs> so having only, you know, seven, less than 10 trades is really the goal. Um, so anything less than that, I'm I'm happy about. But keeping it closer to five is really what I would like. Um, you know, the less is more. You don't have to pay as many fees. So if you're waiting for the right setups, you can really ride that wave down, you know, and just have a much less stressful uh, trading day. So that's what I've been doing is kind of entering that order and then adjusting my stop loss and take profit as it's moving. You know, sometimes you get shaken out, which is one of the biggest frustrations I had in the first couple days of this was um, getting stopped out within 10, 15 seconds over and over and the next thing you know you know you're down 500 on the day within 15 minutes because you're just you know just over trading so uh, you live and you learn and I'm definitely learning a lot here but anyways that's about all I have for the day I don't think I have too much more to say not trying to rhyme but hey I hope you have a happy day and I'll see you tomorrow